A man killed over $150. That's according to a moment by moment account of the deadly confrontation at this Paramore tow yard. Police say 35 year old Tremaine Polk tried to pay $135 for his towed car when he owed $285, then got angry with tow lot workers. When they warned him they would call police, the report states he left the office, but not the property. I was sitting on the porch with my seven month old baby and I seen him jump the fence. According to that report, after smashing several car windows on the other side of this fence, Polk got into his own car and started trying to drive it through that garage out of the lot. While Polk was fighting with employees trying to get out, the report says business owner, 53 year old Paul Gren, took out a gun and held it by his side, warning Polk that police were on their way. The witnesses in the report, who all work for Gren at the lot, told police Polk started to leave, but then turned around and fired his gun three times, hitting Gren. Gren was rushed to the hospital, but died. He had his workers to do their job and someone just killed him because they couldn't get his car. In five years of living across from the lot, Jasmine Brown says she's never heard a commotion like this at that business. He was he was just a nice man. He didn't mess with no one. Workers at the tow lot were too upset to go on camera, but say Gren always treated them like family. Reporting in Paramore, Hadass Brown, West 2 News.